What is this? Pros and cons. Con. Dad. Everyone will know me as the gay kid. What is this? That's mine. It's none of your business. That's what it is. You're gay? Yeah. That's right. And he doesn't know if he should tell the people at school because believe it or not, everybody isn't as accepting as they should be. Danny, let, let me show you something. Come here. I got this when I was in Vietnam. Who's that? That is Douglas, his old Marine buddy. Can I tell this story, please, Junior? Here, sit down. When I was in Vietnam, there was this other guy in my platoon. His name was Douglas. He's a top-notch guy. Wasn't a big talker. But you get really close really fast in those situations. One night, we were in this foxhole because we were gonna take this hill the next morning. Douglas took the first watch. He must have thought I was sleeping because he took his helmet off and he pulled this picture out. He was talking to it. I didn't know what he was saying, but you could tell it was pretty, pretty sweet stuff. I remember thinking how nice it was that he had somebody back home, even if he didn't want to talk about his girl with the rest of us. Next thing you know, I woke up and there were Shots being fired, and, and then I felt something fall on me heavy. And, and I guess he figured that I wasn't going to wake up in time, so he used this body to, to shield me. The first bullet killed him instantly. Before the medics came, I noticed his helmet was on the ground and, and this picture had fallen out. And suddenly it all made sense to me why he kept to himself, why he never talked about girls with the rest of us. I heard the medics approaching, so I took this picture and I put it in my pocket. I knew they were gonna collect all his stuff and send it to his parents, so I wanted to protect his secret. But thinking back on it now, I, I don't think I did the right thing. Because they should have known who he was. And then maybe they did. The way a father knows his son. Look, I don't know what all this stuff is. But I do know that if that's who you are, you shouldn't be ashamed of it. Because anyone who loves you isn't gonna let that stop them from loving you. And anyone who doesn't isn't worth a damn.